Did you know that reading is a sort of workout for your brain? This is because the brain is like a muscle. By practicing your reading, you make your brain stronger, improve your concentration, and become a better reader. We live in a world where we are exposed to a wealth of text both on paper and on screens. We meet the texts in school, when we read on our computer or tablet, and when we read books. Yet there are many situations where you read in your spare time. This can be when reading messages on your phone, reading subtitles on a YouTube video, when you are out shopping, or when you cook and look at a recipe. There are few places where we do not meet text. It can easily become overwhelming, especially when we are reading text of all kinds, subjects, lengths and difficulty level. With this in mind, it's no wonder that our reading abilities are put to the test, as reading is not only about reading a text word for word. To become a good reader, you should be able to form a mental overview of the text, so it's easier to understand and navigate in. This will make it easier to read text in the different school subjects. But this requires learning good ways to approach the reading of the many different texts. Luckily, there is a way to easily and quickly get a grasp of what a text is about. This means that you can quickly judge what part of the text you need to read thoroughly, which part you can just skim, and whether the text is even relevant. When you have learned the new strategies, you will be able to read better both in school and in your spare time. It will also be easier for you to learn new skills. This is because you've learned to approach reading in a new and better way. You will learn to activate your pre-understanding, you'll learn to skim read, and you'll train the muscles in your eyes making you a stronger reader. In the next video, we'll look at how this works.